it's Amanda. So today is day 25th of the Marion Smith Challenge and I know I'm really late and I haven't been on in a while. Um, it's just been a hectic, hectic like year so far. Um, so I'm hoping um, I can get more um, videos up and everything like that and I actually called Flip and they were on, I was on the phone with them for two hours and they could still not figure out what was wrong with my computer. Um, that why it wasn't taking any of my flips. So um, that's why I'm kind of late on everything because I record them and I'm, I'm not able to upload them. So anyway, um, I want to show you for day 25 um, the cards that I made. And I have been making a lot of cards, and I have been using, um, sorry, really sorry about that. Um, I've been using this embellishing paper that I got from Tuesday Mornings, and I really like all these papers. They're really, really cute, and um, I just went hog wild on them and designed some cards. So, and I used that, and I also used um, the... Blossom and Buttons from Great Escape, and those, um, I just seem, seem like they matched a whole lot better with it, so, um, the one card that I'm about to show you is not finished yet, I still have to add just a few more things and probably a saying to it, but this is what it came up with, um, I wanted to use a lot of buttons on this card, and I just wanted it to be fun and cute. And I think I'm going to add a few things right here and then a saying, either on the side of here or have the card open like this. I'm not sure. And let me move you back. I'm sorry. So that way you can see it. And that's one of them. I'm not sure what kind of card this is going to be. That's one of them. Here's another card that I still have to add a saying to it. And I just went ahead and added some flowers and added some ribbon to it. I'm so sorry. I'm not going to stop the video just because my phone went off. <laughs> anyway, so that's another card. And let's see. Here's one that I made. My girlfriend is having a baby, but she's not sure if she's having a boy or a girl. So I went ahead and I um, just made her this card that I thought was really, really cute. That's a butterfly, Jolie's Punch, that I love. And then my mom just had surgery, so um, I wanted to get her just to get better card, and um, this is what I came up with. I used, I really like this blue paper, it's really, really pretty. And then it just says, get well at the bottom, don't mind my handwriting, it's really bad. And I need a new gel pen because this one is running out. So, and then I just tied that along. And that's it. That's all my cards um, that I made so far. Uh, I'm just, from now on when I make one card, I'm probably going to make at least two or three because that way I'm not rushing at the end of the day to um, get a card together or something like that. And this collection, if you guys um, haven't seen my hauls, this is from Tuesday morning and it was 99 cents for this whole thing of pa pattern paper. So, um, really, um, some nice, fun things. I have an idea for this paper right here. I'm going to cut out this and actually make something into that. Um, and it also has, and there's a lot of sheets of it. So, let's see, eight sheets of each of these. Then there's the striped one you have seen, and that one is probably my favorite. Because I love I love blue and brown, and then this one right here, I haven't used this one yet, so that's gonna be a challenge to use that and this one as well. Oh, I didn't even see that. That's really pretty. I like that. I might cut that out or something. The only thing I don't like about this paper is um, when you cut it or when you pull it out, sometimes it rips a little. So um, that's the only thing that I don't really like about that. And um, so. I like it so far, um, except this is going to be kind of hard to cut this out because this might rip a little bit. But um, I'll try it and see how it works. Alright guys, I'll be back. See you guys later. Bye.